Hey guys, Wraith calling Warren Silvergarsk. This is the snow map. I am with the tier 8 French tank, the premium French tank, CDC. My buddy Psycho Pooch is not playing already for a change. He's actually in the motherland. He's going to be using tanking with that. And our buddy Starboy is in the tier 7 premium white tank. American, the Lycan, which is the T71, sort of, kind of, pretty close. So I'm going to use the speed and mobility of the uh, CDC and I'm going to push very aggressively. Uh, we want to try to take this corner and keep their light fast, light tanks and medium tanks from getting to this corner first. Uh, but if you can get to right here in like C1, you can get up this hill and shoot down on everybody coming across that corner. And that's right where I'm going to start with. Uh, but I'm going to keep pushing. I don't want to be here. If we're coming from the other side, this is where you want to sit. Uh, but if you're coming attacking from the south spawn, if you've got mobility and speed, this is not a bad place to sit. Now, the caveat is, there is no Artie. Alright? Had there been Artie, I probably would not sit here nearly as comfortably or as long as I was. Because Artie will nuke you if you sit here from that corner. So you see right here, I'm just getting a couple spots in. I'm going to try to get a couple cheeky shots in. Team is for looking for a little help for the T-32. Now, see where I'm at. There's enough trees between me and him. Is I can sit here and you can see my rounds coming from this area. Uh, he can't actually see me put shots in. Um, so I'm not lit up for him. I'm stealthed up. There's enough tree cover between us. I'm trying to track him, keep him pinned there. I'm getting that assistance tracking damage while I can. Uh, and I may am hitting him. I put another one in him. Into him. He's about gone. And I'm creating problems for those guys, the enemy tanks. They can't push this way. They know the T-32 is being shot. He knows he's being shot. There's not a whole lot he can do about it. So I'm actually going to come down here and push down aggressively to the next little location. And this is part of map awareness. You can see all our guys there kind of fighting those guys in the corner where they traditionally go. Now I'm pushing up here a little bit. Now I can't get spotted from sitting here. This is a little better spot to be safe from already. But I see the T-25 too. And he does spot me right away. So, um, this gun will go through my armor. Uh, so I'm trying to angle up, maybe get a little better rate of fire on him. Fire and pull back right away. You'll see his round come screaming and over me. Let the gun settle down, put another shot into him. Now I have to get rid of this guy before I start putting shots on the tanks in the corner that are pressuring our team. Um, I don't want to leave myself exposed and, and get murdered in the process myself. I want to be the murderer, not the murder E. T25. Ooh, we'll play peekaboo with him for a second. Got him. He was trying to duck me up behind that building. So now there's another heavy tank there. There's a couple over there. I'm going to come down here to this corner so I can get cover again. See the size of the T34. Like most American heavies, it is weak on the side. And he's got a very big gun. will easily pen me without a doubt. Of course, it's the CDC. Everything will pen me without a, <laughs> without a doubt. Uh, so I'm going to keep flanking this way a little bit. My guys are going to start to split up. They start going back a little bit. Um, We've got a shots. Uh, I can quite get him. He's just uh, off just for grins and don't quite get it. Um, but I don't know where the other tanks where he's at. There's another tank. There's two tanks back there. So I'm going to try to get out of the way. It's T23-2. He's got a very good rate of fire. Um, and he can beat me up quite a bit so I want to be careful of him because again I don't have any armor he's got a very good rate of fire he's got a pretty accurate gun so I'm just trying to expose as little as I can and he's just going through my he doesn't hit very hard though which is good uh, I might get some teammates put some shots into him and help me finish him off there's another medium sitting over around the corner let's go engage him there he is he's a one shot I pick him off I'll take that kill it's a nice little not on the gun belt. And I'm going to push south. Now the CDC is fast enough I can, I can make this aggressive and get back down to the southern end of the map where the enemy team is holding out and still have an impact on the game. Had I been in something like a T-34 or uh, Black Prince or Carnarvon, it may have taken me a little longer to get back there. But no, we're in a fast, speedy, no armored French medium tank. The team's mopping him up at this point. It's just not quite done with the crying yet. And looking, because we're not sure where they're at, so I'm trying to get some vision, get some flanking shots in. 
be the murderer and not the murder me. And there is mutant knife. Shoot! Hit, don't hit the mutant. Hit the other guy with me. I think it's a comet. But I want to kill the mutant. The mutant's got a very big gun, very lots of armor. And I gotta be worried of the comet now because the comet will out DPM me if I'm not careful. Buddy in the. Uh, you can find out how our way doesn't have a lot of armor. There's the comet. Oh, it's a knight. I'm sorry, not a comet. He's like the same thing. Sets me on fire, and I don't get the fire extinguisher put out. Yeah. So, yeah. It's no good. So, we're on a star boy, and he's making a push with the lichen. And I don't remember what tank story is left. Up, oh, there's Ramatal Borsig. Starboy comes around the corner. I don't recommend this doing this at home. Um, and gets picked off by the Lycan. Sorry, Starboy. Should have pushed on him and made him turn. Uh, there comes Pooch. Pooch can't take a hit either. The, potentially, all these tanks on our friendly team is beat up. Uh, the Borsig could cover. But Gary picked him off and gets rid of him. Good job, Pooch. Appreciate your help. Always a team player in the end. So, let's look at the final stats, guys. Again, there's some missions going on, and there's some times two, so don't be worried about the money. Uh, three kills, 3,700 damage, 1,000 assisted. 18 penetrations, high caliber, first class mastery. Pretty good game. I was pretty excited about this game. I was a little happy. I'll take a game like this. Um, look at the final numbers. CDC, I had 1,600 base XP. My eyes are getting bad. 1,600, three kills, 3,700 damage. As always, guys, thanks for watching, and keep your powder dry.